Tonight we're rolling out a new weekly segment we call Up to Code. Every Wednesday, NBC4's Tom Susie will make sure your restaurants, food trucks, food courts, even school cafeterias are safe and up to code. All new tonight at 6, Central Ohio's most experienced investigative reporter joins us with this first report. Tom. Hey guys, the Franklin County Board of Health did something it rarely does. It closed the restaurant. We've arrived at this point because we've exhausted all of our options with this facility. All those in favor? Aye. 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 The Franklin County Board of Health voted unanimously Tuesday to suspend the license of Banduri Cuisine Restaurant here at the 3200 block of Cleveland Avenue. Franklin County Public Health Supervisor Garrett Giozzi. This facility has had a total of 12 inspections since January 2016. Typically, a facility of this license classification would receive two standard inspections per year. During that period, inspectors uncovered a total of 144 violations here. 34 of them critical, like improper date marking, unsafe food temperatures, and person in charge unable to demonstrate proper food safety knowledge. These pictures the health department provided us show another ongoing concern at this restaurant, a lack of overall cleanliness. My name is Kozar Abdullahi. A spokesperson for the restaurant says they've hired a new manager. Employees are attending the county's food safety classes, and many of these critical violations are corrected. In the future that we you would see a significant change. If Banduri Cuisine Restaurant passes its follow-up inspection on January 19th, they can reopen that day. If they don't pass, they could lose their license. And our recommendation will be that the board revoke your license. Now, as I said, it's very unusual for health departments to take such drastic measures. Last year, Franklin County Public Health temporarily closed just two restaurants. Well, I'm curious, have they, over the years, how often have they entirely revoked somebody's license, just taken it away? I've been doing this about seven years in town, maybe a couple, nothing recently. It's the last thing they want to do, guys. Uh, you're talking small businesses, you're talking yeah. employees, so they take this stuff very seriously. All right, dinner on you tonight, Tom? Sure. Okay. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Is it payday? Join us every Wednesday night at 6 o'clock to watch our up to code reports and by visiting our website, NBC4i.com, to see our new investigative segment.